Need anything? How's life in the hot springs? Yeah, I can upgrade that. Need anything else? Thanks. Powerful. Good shot. You'll like this one. Come by if you still need something. Why aren't Thanks, you Deacon. Working? Come on. I'm just gonna close my eyes for a bit. Ah! Okay, let's go. Can I help you? You here for your bike? Hey, what's up? Whew. Stuff's getting scarce. See ya. Uh, hold on, I'll get the door. Chopper without being seen and give him hell, brother. Remember what Jack used to say? Don't ride faster than your guardian angel can fly. Like I said, Jack used to say a lot of stupid shit. Peek it out. Alright, let's go see what the hell Nero is up to. Alright, got some questions for you. Deacon St. John, you out there? Got a job for you here at the hot spring. Doctor, okay, I'll head your way. St. John out. This time you got me. I'll take all the guns I can get my hands on. Ain't no one taking them away from me.
So, you want to learn how to hunt? Is that what I'm hearing? I know how to shoot a gun. It's a rifle, not a gun. I was in the 10th Mountain Cope. Don't give me any Marine Corps bullshit. Killing a buck's a little different than killing a man. Or a freak. The best way to hunt an animal is to track it. You gotta focus. And see what nature's trying to tell you. If you look hard enough, you'll see the signs. pile of deer scat it's fresh yeah i see it lead really this way <laughs> yeah i can see that well come on man quick there's your buck <sighs> i see him now here use my rifle if you were in the 10th mountain you know how to use a scope yeah, Cope, I know how to use a scope. Easy, easy. You got him. Nice shot. Oh, God damn it! it wasn't a kill shot. He got away. Oh, no, that's okay. You wounded him. He'll bleed out soon enough. We just gotta track him. <sighs> okay. Look close. Yeah, I see him. Then follow him. On it. He'll be slowing down about now. Losing too much blood. We should be coming across his carcass any time now. Okay, you know how to gut an animal? Yeah, look, Cope, Boozer, and I have been hunting before. He used to go elk hunting with his old man, and yeah, he uh, he showed me how to gut a deer. Well, let's just say no disrespect to Boozer, but you got a lot to learn. You're wasting a lot of meat there. Overall, not bad for a beginner. Yeah, thanks. Now, I'll take back that rifle. Here, thanks. Like I said, Deke, we can always use more venison at the camp. Still got some folks trying to heal up from that Ripper attack. Okay, Cope. Yeah, I'll see if I can remember that. Just... Check. Gotta open the gate. You, uh, need something, man? What's up, Manny? Okay, man. All right, check back later, man. See ya. What are you? Hey, Dick. Manny, I'm still not happy with you. You got a problem. How's it going, booze man? Fine, goddammit. Hey, Dick, we're getting low on supplies. We can use some more meat if you get a chance. Shit, okay. Uh, I guess it's been a while since we did any hunting. I'll see if I can scare up some meat while I'm out. You, uh, you remember what you're doing? Uh, yeah, I had Cope give me a few pointers, believe it or not. Cope? Oh, shit, I don't believe it. Thanks, D. See you, Blue Man. Fresh. <laughs> okay, I just gotta get this back to Blue Man. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. I grew up in these here woods. My grandfather taught me all about them. Funny how it still works in the world he never would have dreamed of. I built my first tree house to use as a deer blind. Getting high on the target helps your aim and keeps you safe. Back then, 
I took out my first doe from up top. Today, my camp's up in the trees. You want to survive and can contribute. You come to me. We got you covered. Grandfather also taught me to catch a doe. Sometimes you gotta lay an ambush. Hide where they need to go. Like a watering hole. Today, you're as likely to be a as hunter. So you gotta keep your eyes peeled when you're in the places we all need to go. My grandfather always said the easiest way to a good meal was to lay a trap. Stand by a tree, and you could have dinner next time you come now. But careful. A headless snake can still bite. Especially when it ain't really dead. <laughs> My grandfather would have outlived us all. Let me tell you. This is... Sarge, how about we make an unscheduled stop on our way back? A couple of sample traps I want to check. Hey, Doc, how long before your job's done? I'm not a doctor. I keep telling you that. Sorry, Lieutenant O'Brien. How long are we going to be here? Okay, Doc. Lieutenant, don't become carrion yourself. Only animals can become carrion, Corporal Matthew. You guys check the perimeter, right? Yeah, damn it. You're so close. I heard something. <laughs> Anyone else hear that? This way, you poor son of a bitch. At least you weren't torn apart by freaks. If you lived a few more weeks, you might have become one yourself. Now, what had that been something? Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Do what you want. Stay back. I just want to talk. Uh, Nero Protocol 2-7 states clearly that uh, if conducting operations in quarantine zones, that if I encounter any civilians or sub... sub Civilians that I'm forbidden from making contact. Really? See, that sounded to me like making contact. Yes. Yes, it did. You're alive. Yes. I am. How? How are you alive? What? I, I, I don't understand. Okay. You were there that night. Farewell. The next uh, night, Nero camp. Protocol 2 the 7 were states. I, Everyone was dead. They were slaughtered, seven. torn limb Nero for goddamn limb. Protocol All right, listen up. We're going to do this the easy way or the hard way. The easy way, we have a little chat. You give me the information that I need, and then you go back to digging your way through freaker shit or whatever the hell else you're doing out here. The hard way. I 
crack open that little space suit, and then we see what your friends out there have to say about you breathing in all this contaminated air. So what's it gonna be, O'Brien? Yes. Okay. Okay. You remember the rooftop of the old brewery? I put a woman on your chopper. She was wounded. Yes. I remember, a, a knife wound. She, she was cut pretty bad. I went to the refugee camp that you said you were taking her to. Everyone was dead, so I'm gonna ask you again. How did you survive? Uh, we weren't there. We were diverted south to another camp. Like you said, the camp in Belknap was overrun, so they moved us south to a camp outside of Silver Lake. Were there survivors? You mean now? I don't know. I, I was transferred to the research unit. Did she survive? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, 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 I can find out. I, I can check. You, you have one of our radios. That's how you... Uh, I, I can't promise anything, but I'll, I'll check. Uh-huh, and I'm going to go with you. No, Come on. You, you can't. Please, you don't... Hey, you don't understand. I'll fucking shoot you. Not before I shoot you. Okay, look, if you're going to fucking kill me, do it, okay? I did my job. Did that woman, your wife... I put her on oxygen, I gave her an IV. I kept her alive. I got in a lot of trouble for that. She was septic, she wasn't gonna make it, but I got out of the mass unit. I saved her goddamn life. O'Brien, report. I have to go, please. You have to get out of here. You don't know these men. You don't know Brian, what they're capable of. If I don't hear from you, I don't care how long it takes, I'm gonna track you down. And I'm gonna do a lot worse than snap off an antenna. I'm sorry about your wife. But you're not the only one who lost someone that night. he alive? They were diverted south. He said that he put her on oxygen. He gave her IV. He kept her alive. She was septic, so she wasn't going to make it, but he got her to a mass unit. He saved her life. He said it. He said he saved her life. She, she can still be. She can. No, 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 no. No, no. But O'Brien is alive. And if he is, then maybe... Man, um, a few days ago, I asked you if you remembered that Nero asshole O'Brien. Uh, yeah, Deke, it's, it's all uh, kind of a blur. Yeah, yeah, okay. Get some shit on Booze Man. I'll tell you about it later. What are we riding out of here, Deke? Come on. Soon. Real soon. Look, <clears throat> as soon as your arm heals, we're fucking riding the hell out of here. Yeah, Deke. I see you running around. O'Brien. Are you out there? O'Brien! Oh, you son of a bitch, you better radio me. You hear me, O'Brien? I know you're on this channel. God damn it. Okay, you better get back to me or I'm going to track you down. You got that? Oh, God damn it. Oh, come on! Ryan, get back to me. Deke, you there? Did you track down the chopper? Was it the same guy, the one we saw on the roof that night? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it, it was him. And did he remember us? Sarah, what happened? I don't know. They got diverted south. He, he remembered her, but he doesn't know what happened to her. 
You know, I... You don't think she's still alive? What if... No. No, look, I'm not stupid, loser. I just want to find out, you know, what happened to her. Or she died. I don't need to find any peace. Jesus. I, I gotta go, all right? Deacon out. Okay, now just gotta carve it up. I can sell this. Hey, man. Hey, Boozer. You gonna be up all night? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. Hey, Booze Man. I brought in some meat. Should keep us stocked up for a while. Hey, Deke, thanks, man. I'm not real hungry right now. I'll salt it up in a bit. Like Boozer says, I hear a bunk calling my name. <sighs> that should do it.
it's on the road. Damn it. Open up. Huh. How's it going? Looks like you've got a few ears here. Can I help you? Yeah. We got stuff if you need it. We're gonna run out of this someday, you know. Come back soon. See you around. It's safe here. I have to work. Okay. Okay. What do you want? Deke, uh, I, I need you to go after someone. Go after someone? Okay, what's going on? Right after you brought in that girl, Lisa. Larson brings in another one. Name was Rose Allen, a weak little hey, thing. Get but your we ass figured back she could to pull work. her own weight. Help hey, us get this irrigation hey, no, ditch no, done. No, 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 don't. Uh, okay, so uh, what all right. you She's all right. gone. She went on a supply Stop run it. with Alki. Some others up to that abandoned Nero refugee camp. You know, the one, I, I think you've been up there before. Yeah, 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 I know the one. Find her, Deke. There's been a bunch of drifters and squatters spotted up that way. If, if they find her first. Yeah, 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 okay, I'm, I'm gonna see what I can do. You here for your bike? Hey, what's going on? Hey, I'll be back. Let me get the gate for you. John Salome Hot Springs. Talk to you there. Yeah, Deke. I'm here. Hey, I'm at that location where the girl was last seen. Looks like they uh, got hit by a swarm. If she was here, probably not much chance she's still alive. If she is, you'll find her. Tuck her out.
I got a use for you. Take a closer look. What do we got? I mean, might be here somewhere, right? No, oh, Jesus, looks like the swamp tore him apart. <laughs> Rose? Rose Allen, right? No! No! Hey, 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 I'm not gonna hurt you, see? I'm uh, not with those assholes. No! No! God damn it, I'm here to help. Tucker sent me. Wait, wait, I said that I am here to help you. No! You're with her. You're from the work camp. No, no, I'm with Tucker. I, uh, I, I do runs for, yeah. They starved me. I wouldn't follow her orders, so they wouldn't feed me. Well, I mean, it's a work camp. I mean, everyone's got to work. I'm not a slave. I'm not going back, do you hear me? I'd rather die out here. Okay, 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 God damn it. Go on.
Hey, me again. Boozer says that I shouldn't come up here anymore. He keeps asking me what goods it do, and, and maybe he's right, I don't know. He got hurt pretty bad the other day. We ran into some rippers who burned the hell out of his arm, and it looks pretty bad. I broke into one of those, uh, uh, what the hell do you call them, the mobile medical units? I mean, I got him sterile bandages. And I hope it's enough, you know? But Boozer, you know, he says he's fine, but I, I, don't, I don't think so. Shit looks pretty bad to me. See, the thing is, it was on me. I risked his life for a bike part. Goddamn bike part. Not that it mattered, and son of a bitch Copeland parted it out anyway. <sighs> Took me a year to put that bike together. You would have liked it. It's not as nice as the one that I taught you to ride on, but it got me around. You remember that tank that you had painted for me? Well, that was the only thing left of that old hog, and now it's gone, too. As soon as we get it back together, I, my bike, I mean, and get Boozer patched up, we're gonna ride north. Fresh start. You know, a lot of memories around here. Too many. Anyway, I guess I'm just saying that, uh, I might not see you again. You know? Deer crossing, wow, that's not too smart, even without the traffic. I spotted him and it looks like he was, uh, like he was waiting for someone. Deke. Don't let him get away. I want him alive. Oh, come on, Rhodes. Where do you think you're going, huh? Oh, Go shit. back here, you son of a I bitch. What? All right, so let's so do this the hard way. Oh, slow down. I just want to talk. Yeah? Oh, I took a set you. Talk? Well, yeah, goddammit. If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead. <sighs> Up your ass! I know what you've done to Leon and Alvarez! Oh, I got you, son of a bitch! Hey, Roach. How's it going, buddy? See? 
Told you I wasn't gonna kill you. Ah, uh, uh, Deke, no. No, oh, I, I didn't do nothing. Uh, uh. Nah, that's not what Tucker says. I guess when Leon and Alvarez took off with the camp's drugs, they forgot to cut you in. Is that about it? Uh, uh, Deke, no. No, no, no. Clue me in on what you're thinking, man. I, I want to understand. You, you took what was left while the old woman wasn't looking? Oh, Deke, uh, I got nothing on me, okay? Search me. Uh. <laughs> no, I'm not. It's not my job. I'm going to leave that up to Alki. Hey, Tuck, I got Deke, him. Uh, Mark down these coordinates me here. and have Al Kai I heard what you did to Leon, okay, Deke? I, 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 please, man. He's alive. Come on, please. Did he have my drugs? Deke, no. Please, please, we rode together, remember? Ooh, yeah, he's you alive. and me, we were friends. If you want to stay that way, Al Kai, you better hurry up and get off his ass. St. John out. Please, please. Uh, hey, Boozman, you hey there? Uh, don't yeah, me out here. Crazy question. Any idea where I can find a thunder egg? What the hell for? The kid I brought in, just trying to find a way to cheer her up. She mentioned having one. Shit, I don't know. Check the gift shop at Belknap Crater. I don't know, maybe Marion Forks. Yeah, okay, thanks. Fuck! Keep going! I've been watching for it! it. Sniper on the road. Oh, God damn it. God damn it, not now. Watch it like that, huh? Shoot at me, you fucking bastard.
Someone's yeah. trapped. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. Hey, hey, it's not safe out here in the shit. I know where there's a camp. No, no, where? Where? I'll go. Go toward Three Finger Jack, find the Salome Hot Springs, talk to Alki Turner. He'll help you out. <gasps> Thank you so much. I thought I was gonna die in there. <sighs> Tell him it was Deacon. They'll know. Don't stop, just keep out of sight. Something specific. See ya. Now. 
Hey, what's up? What else can I do for you? Come by if you still need something. Okay. I'll be back. Need something. Going for a walk. Lisa, I... Go away. I brought you some. It's beautiful. Will you take me with you? Take me back to Marion Forks. Look, I, I can't because it's not safe. I gotta turn in. They make us get up really early for work. What's happening? What? All right. I see how it is. Later. Can I help you? Can I help you? Hey, just taking a look. Hold on a second. I'll get it. St. John, you out there? We got a job for you here at Peaceful Lake. Nope. Yeah, okay. Um, I'll head your way. St. John out.
Here we go. Hey, uh, you're not answering the radio. Yep. I know, I was... Well, hold on, hold on. No, I'm all right, I'm all right. Just... Trying to get clear, you know? You're burning up. Ugh, my head's pounding like a mother. You're burning up. No, 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 I'm just, I'm just tired. Okay, stay here, rest. I'll think of something. Look, I don't need a goddamn babysitter, I'm fine.